Okay guys, I'm going to try to do a tutorial on how to rotate a wheel here in uh, Milkshape 3D. Now what I did is I created, basically this will be my axle and this will be my wheel. Very, very uh, high quality there. Alright, first what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a skeleton. So I'm going to go here, I'm in the model, I'm going to go to joint, and then I'm going to click, now we'll say right out here, and then click right out here. Alright, so this is the joint that will rotate the wheel. Now I have to assign these two, the vertices to the bones. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to go to joints. I'm going to select joint 1. You'll see that that highlights. Go to groups. Select cylinder 1 by double clicking. I'm double clicking with the uh, left mouse button to select these guys. Now I have the uh, joint one highlighted and cylinder one highlighted and I'm just going to go back to the joints and I'm going to assign the vertices to that and now I'm going to go over here again to joint two I'm going to double click and now you see that that's highlighted go back to group cylinder two yep. double click now they're both highlighted. Go back to joints, and I'm going to assign those. All right. So right now, that's how to build the skeleton. Okay. Now I got my skeleton built. Now I'm going to go here to select. I'm in the model pane. Select. I want to select the joint, and I'm going to drag it over this guy here. That's my joint too. Now I set my just for this tutorial. I set my uh, max frames and everything to 40 just to uh, make it simple to rotate. Now when you're uh, rotating the wheel you want to spin around you have to figure out along which axis plane you are. Now see I'm through I'm facing my model faces the Z so I'll be rotating around the Z axis. So what I'm going to do here is I'm on let me click down here go to frame my animation mode now. Let me go into animation mode and go back. So now I'm set down here. You can see I'm at frame one. Now what I want to do is you can go up into animate and set keyframe, which is also Control K for the eye uh, to do it quickly. So I'm going to set that as a keyframe, and you'll see that the bone highlighted that's yellow. So that means that it uh it set that keyframe. Now when animating you want to set it to the next frame before you click the uh, set the keyframe. So I'm just going to go from one, I'm going to watch it down here, I'm going to go up to frame and then for a slow, no kidding, slow. I'm going to go to frame 10 and you see it telling me it's frame 10 right there. Now what I'm going to do here is I'm going to go to rotate and I know that I want to rotate in the Z axis. So if I want, I can lock those out. And I'm going to go to local just for the hell of it. And I'm going to set this up and type in 90. Degrees, I want to rotate 90. So I'm going to rotate it. And it rotated 90 degrees. And I'm going to use my quick keys. Control K and set that keyframe. Now I'm going to go back down here, go to frame 20, and then I'm going to go up here again, just keep it at 90, and I'm going to click rotate, and you can see that it's kind of rotating, and then I'm going to click control K again, and then I'm going to go back down here, and go to frame 30, rotate it again 90, hit control K, and then I'm going to go back down here and take up the frame all the way to frame 40, rotate it again at 90, hit control K, and that sets the keyframes. 
Now if I take this and scrub backwards, you'll see it rotating. And it should highlight, you know, it should highlight when you get to the, uh, the set keyframes. But anyway, so that's that. And then I will click, I'll highlight this down here. I will click play. And you see the wheel is now rotating. So that's very simple how to uh, how to create a rotating wheel in Milkshape 3D. And as you can see, the little joint diner is rotating. Well, I hope this helped out, and I hope you can figure out how to make a wheel rotate. All right, guys, thanks for watching.